Aquaba from DRC to Cameroon and now in Ghana. We have officially launched the climate justice movement in Ghana. It's important that we address climate injustices in the continent through bringing together movements, organizations, and challenging the status quo of the policy direction. In Ghana, we hope that we'll be having very engaging deliberations with partners, with government agencies, with civil society organizations, as well as communities that are at the front line of addressing the climate crisis. I'm very happy about the launch of this coalition. It was very overwhelming as it was refreshing. The environmental challenges that we are facing in Ghana are not very different from the challenges in DRC, in Cameroon, in Kenya and other African countries. That is why it's important that we work together in collaboration with civil society organizations working on food, working on energy, working on biodiversity conservation and forestry to fight the injustices that our communities are facing. The triple planetary crisis are here with us. Climate change, biodiversity loss, plastic pollution. It's the time to act faster now and that is why the climate justice movement for Ghana is a great movement. But this is the time to demonstrate collective action and responsibility with our common shared missions and actions to empower the communities we serve and for people and planet. It's good to see that there are actually more players in this space trying to protect the environment and so I think it's going to further our cause as a civil society organization to have a heavier voice. When we say things it comes with the backing of a greater constituency and that's what the environment in Ghana needs right now. A unified purpose. We've gathered solutions to environmental issues that communities in Ghana face. We are amplifying their voices at the AU ECOSOC this week. See you there.